Nuach Arailin and Eshka D on Nua Halen, or to Will Robin Egtach the Deer Air Andrew, Air Shortland Street. The Kaufman isn't intended for people like Amanda. It's basically a long term care facility for hopeless cases. Chris and his family have always thought that Amanda was a hopeless case. Well, so did I. Until I got to know her. Sashimi, right? It's a word she doesn't know. Gravel, she won't want that. And ice cream, that's the one she'll pick. Well, you're probably giving a non-verbal cues. That's what she's responding. You think it's a trick? Anyone would think you'd be glad to have some hope for Amanda. I am a doctor. I'm past snatching at straws. You lock her away in an institution on the other side of the world you hardly ever visit. It's like you're embarrassed about her. The flame turns out to be right. Then she gets some go at a real life, but you won't even admit the possibility. Lock her away, just like the Bruce did. Hey, I am nothing like my father. Nothing. Sure about that, Chris? Tanya, I'm at your place. Um, I thought you were already done shopping by now, but hey, if you're going to be much longer, can you give me a room? There you go. Good evening, boys. Hi. <laughs> so, are you a regular lady killer or what? Yeah, mood killer more like it. Huh? The brother broke the first rule of scoring and shut up about his ex-girlfriend. Oh, sweetheart. Jake, Jake, Jake. No one wants damage goods, even if it is only for one night. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Maybe I'm just not ready. Yeah, about time. Oh, sorry to keep you waiting. There were just too many shoes in desperate need of attention. So, what's going on anyway? What's going on is that I'm bailing. Thanks for the invite. Oh, that's cool. Sorry, credit card wasn't up to it. See ya. Could have been nasty. Oh, right. The old, we've broken up so we can't be in the same room together thing. Oh, I remember what it was like to be 17. More like the old Claire slept with someone behind my back, so now I can't stand the sight of her thing. Did she? Anyway, Tarrant, shall I take you away from all this? My place? I'll never understand people who just can't be honest if they're thinking of moving on. My man feels the need to do the duty, I mean. Rather, he just told me. Jake just needs a revenge relationship. Please, no. You make the biggest mistakes when you're on the rebound. Well, what else is the brother supposed to do? Well, just try and forget about girls for a while. Focus on something else in your life. Like? I don't know. But here's the tip. If a girl thinks you're too busy for her, she'll do anything to distract you. Amanda? If you're gonna prove me wrong, could you please do it soon? on a mission? Oh. Getting out and getting some exercise before I get too big to walk. Yeah, twins. It's a bit scary. <sighs> Carrying one was hard enough. Well, at least you've got Hamish to hold your hand. Jay mentioned that you were seeing each other. I think it's great. Really? Yeah. I guess you must be getting some funny looks starting a relationship when you're pregnant, but well, it's proof that Hamish isn't just interested in your body, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> I've actually got a newfound respect for the guy. Did you know that he's my brother? Mum had him adopted out when she was 15. Yeah, yeah, you mentioned. Yeah, I haven't really got to know him yet. But maybe the four of us could have dinner one night, me and Jay and you and Hamish. Maybe. Okay. Yeah, well, I'll give you a call when I'm back from my management course. That well, sounds great. Cool. <laughs> What do you think? Very nice. Hello, the shoes, Mark. Huh? Huh? Yeah. I've just got.
got to wear them in. Go for it. Claire was going to buy them. Lucky for me, her credit card was maxed out. Retail karma, huh? Because she did the duty on Jake. Maybe. I can't understand why she'd let such a nice guy like him go. She's such a lonely little thing. He's a teenager, he'll get over it. Everything always seems so major. A few weeks later, won't even remember what he's so miserable about. Are you going to this? What's this? It's an invitation to a fundraiser for Shortland Street. Invitation to boredom, more like. Remind me again why you're hanging out with a 17-year-old girl? Mm, she invited herself last night. And I guess I feel a bit sorry for her. She doesn't seem like she has many friends. Maybe if you weren't so encouraging, she'd go out and get some her own age. I am not encouraging her. It was only one night out. She's actually pretty cool. Seems a lot older than she is. Anyway, I can't believe you're not going to go to this. Do you not care about your career at all? Not enough to spend my night off with some do-gooders from Ferndale Heights. Come on, we'll impress the pants off the old biddies. You with your charm and me with my new shoes. You actually want to go to this? It's a cocktail party, Mark. I never turn down a cocktail. <laughs> and I'm sure we can manage to have some fun. Can we go? Can we? Sure. Whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs>